Right, back again. <coughs> You'll remember that the original solid state relay is, uh, is just fitted into the, uh, the middle here and the kit contains two new ones so you can utilize the two holes from the original one and uh, just screw these gently in place. You'll notice the DC is to the inside, AC is to the outside on each and, uh, and then just mark the position of the hole that you need to drill on each side uh, pivot these up and away and uh, just drill through deburring them and there's two new screws uh, to fit these with uh, nylock uh, nuts and uh, you're all good to go uh, with that just got to do the rest of the wiring here um, something that you could use if you felt like it the original uh, SSI has a plastic cover and what I've done is just scored it with a knife and broken it into two and if you felt inclined to you could just cover the uh, AC terminals on uh, on each side with these after you've finished and uh, just a little bit of hot melt or uh, whatever to keep those in place I'll probably use silicon on all of this as the hot melt as you may recall was uh, actually dripping down the display on this <laughs> originally um, so yeah SSI is in place just going to do some more wiring uh, a couple of earth points that need to be cleared of, uh, of paint on the lid uh, something I forgot to mention on the display uh, they, they supply four little brass standoffs that you need to fit uh, into the original standoffs uh, so the PCB is uh, the correct distance from the, the metalwork uh, if you don't fit those it's not going to fit uh, so yeah that's about it I shall be back in a minute uh, when hopefully this will be uh, wired up correctly